part of the President's Climate Action Plan, EPA Administrator Gina McCarthy announced a new set of rules to regulate carbon dioxide emissions, emissions from existing power plants. These regulations would have little effect on the climate, but the rules would have a negative effect on the livelihood of all energy users, including farmers, foresters, and fishermen who are the focus of today's hearing. The President's costly regulations mean that farmers who irrigate their crops by pump would face higher utility bills. Foresters would pay more for electricity to turn their timber into building materials and paper, products that are essential to our economy. These industries already face a myriad of challenges in a difficult economic environment. But at what cost are we going to hurt these economic sectors in the pursuit of aggressive but dubious climate regulations? The costs uh, to these industries are sure to go up. The benefits are not. Farmers have been managing their crops effectively and adapting to variable climate conditions for generations and generations. This is nothing new. Unfortunately, this generation will now have to cope with higher electricity costs because of questionable climate regulations. For farmers who properly manage their land, a changing climate is not the problem, but burdensome regulations that increase the cost of farm production are. America's forests provide many benefits and services to society, including clean water, recreation, wildlife habitat, and a variety of forest products. Need we be reminded that carbon dioxide is required for photosynthesis, the process by which these forests use sunlight to grow. Plants tend to grow better under conditions of higher CO2 levels. Scientists have dubbed this effect CO2 fertilization. The economic impact of our forests must not be overlooked. Forestry in Mississippi is a $14 billion industry and supports more than 63,000 full and part-time jobs. Healthy, productive, and well-managed forests cover more than 60% of my home state. These healthy forests support industry that employs 25% of Mississippi's manufacturing workforce. Given the current depressed market for forestry goods, higher prices for electricity would only worsen industry problems. For foresters who properly manage their trees, a changing climate is not the problem, but onerous regulations that increase the cost of forestry production are.